Hi everyone, this is Valerio and in today's video um, I want to show you how we can create a brand new configuration with Cauldron. So the first thing we have to do is of course log in with our uh, user that we previously created. Once we have done and we have been authenticated, Caldron is going to retrieve all the configuration eventually, all the configuration you have previously created. And now uh, to start uh, um, and create a brand new configuration, you just simply need to click on this red button on the bottom or right of the screen. You click and this uh, is going to be the configuration uh, process with all the information that you need to provide with in order to let them, let Caldron create a brand new configuration for you. So, which information do you need? Some from the customer and some from the uh, commerce instance you already have uh, uh, prepared or you already own in GSC or a production environment to demo this uh, headless uh, configuration that you want to uh, create for your customer. So, as I mentioned, the configuration you need, basically, uh, the customer name, so the brand name of, of the company, the primary and secondary color, there are, you know, branding information of uh, the customer that you are going to meet. In this case, we are pretending to, meeting, uh, to meet uh, a Mitsubishi, so we know already uh, the primary and secondary co color of the company. Then you need your, uh, some uh, information from your GSC or production uh, commerce cloud instance. And those are the, the product collection. What I mean by that? A product collection is something that Caldron needs to retrieve some you know, uh, product in via headless directly from, uh, from the commerce, uh, commerce instance you are using. I will recommend always to use uh, uh, the primary website. And what I mean by that is, uh, in this case, in this uh, GSC instance is the Supreme Interior. You can see the primary website is always listed on top. And from this uh, uh, primary um, website, you uh, just select the collection uh, that you want, to, you want to retrieve, with product that you want to retrieve. In this case, I'm selecting window mounted air conditioner because it's something that Mitsubishi does. So I just copy the collection ID and I can close this, go back to my configuration and then paste it here. The next information we need from commerce is actually the URL of the endpoint of the primary website. In this case, Supreme Interior is my primary website as i mentioned from the gsc um, uh, information inside the demo store and so you can go back to the configuration and paste exactly as i did uh, the information related to the um, url instance the next two couple of information we need is actually the user we are going to use to simulate uh, to generate the configuration to simulate the customer behavior inside the headless application that will be generated by, by Caldron. And this information are the user, uh, user name uh, as a user email and the password of the user you created to showcase your you know, customer journey to the customer. In this case, uh, I will be using my own email address that is already a, a user inside the Supreme Interior website. Bear in mind that you can customize this environment. Uh, the customization in the GSC environment will not affect Cauldron at all. So we will be using Valerio email, and I can select, uh, uh, insert, sorry, the, the related password. The last piece of information is just uh, a company logo. I already downloaded and and now just add the configuration if everything is okay you don't get any error message cauldron is going to generate a brand new configuration for you the last uh, two pieces of information that i want to share 
if you have to go back and change because you know you don't look you don't like the look and feel uh, or some information actually is not correct sometimes you know a collection may not work may not be working properly or you want to change the collection you want to change something in the branding you can just come back go back change the data and update the configuration once you are happy okay you can always test click on generate mitsubishi atlas configuration calder is going to do the work for you so as you can see we have uh, generated a brand new configuration and um, that's it for uh, today I hope you liked the video. I hope it was uh, useful for you to understand how to create a brand new configuration. And as always, have a nice day. Bye.